the power of RSS feed. RSS means really simple syndication. Essentially, uh, this is a bit of a difficult thing to grasp. I know that I struggled with it at first. Essentially what it is is uh, if you create a regular website, it's not going to have it, but essentially any blog that you have uh, comes with its own RSS feed. And what it is is uh, I just picked a, a blog here that I found at random. It's about uh, the TV show Friday Night Lights. And if you go up here, if you look on your toolbar, if you're using Firefox, you will see a symbol like this, which will tell you if there is an RSS feed for the page. If you hit it, um, it will take you to the RSS feed. Let me show you what it looks like. This is a way, this is a feed that will be updated every time you make a new post on your blog. So what you can do is you can take this feed and submit it to uh, lots of different places. You can submit it to um, RSS aggregators, they're called. And in my book, I, I list a, you know, a few that I suggest that you do. Essentially what it does is when you have an RSS feed, it opens up a lot of doors that you normally wouldn't have if you just had a regular website, and it results in a lot of links. Um, RSS is a, is a news thing, and people will, will view your, your site as newsworthy. And the thing is, you get these links put around the net. Every time you create a new post on your blog, all those RSS feeds are going to automatically be updated, and it, it, it spreads the word around. I can also tell you some pretty crazy stories about uh, when you use, utilize RSS feeds properly, you can create a post and get it ranked in the search engines a lot faster because you have a lot more links to it. And again, RSS is, is really hot right now, and it's beyond the scope of this video for me to show you the ins and outs of it, but I strongly suggest that you check it out because it's one of the, the Internet's best kept secrets. Seriously, the people that aren't doing it are really missing out on a lot. And I, I really suggest that you check it out and get involved. And again, if you don't have a blog, this is another good reason to create a blog because a blog automatically comes with its own RSS feed. If you don't have a blog, uh, you know, there are other options for you as well, but nothing quite as easy as a blog. So again, I hope that you'll check it out.